All right, ladies and gentlemen, Jason Hitland here with Rodeo Roundup. One more time backstage, World's Toughest Rodeo 2014, right here at the XL Energy Center, St. Paul. Jeff Richter, a great pickup man, and a, you're a native Minnesotan, if I'm not correct. I am uh, originally from Kansas City, but I did live in Minnesota for the past seven years. So uh, definitely looking forward to getting out of here tonight, though, going to Kansas, back to Kansas City for the Super Bowl because it's way too cold up here. <laughs> and you ain't lying. You know, and you've been down here the last couple of years. We've talked, and I think the last time we ran into each other was going up an escalator at MGM down at the National Finals Rodeo this year. Absolutely. That's the great <laughs> thing about rodeo is, you know, we get to travel all over and, and see good friends like yourself all over the country. So it's pretty cool. Yeah, you know, and, and an interesting fact that a lot of people don't know, you do a heck of a job with a pickup man, but we saw some action last night in the buck and shoots where they were having some problems with the ties on the latches, and you guys were up there with the horses. It's not only roping the animals, but it's protecting the staff and everything else. Talk to us a little bit about that. Yeah, absolutely. You know, uh, the action doesn't always take place in the arena, like you said. I mean, from the moment the horses are loaded or bulls are loaded into the chute, you know, anything could happen. And, you know, we had a few want to be cantankerous last night, but uh, we help out whenever we can. So, Man, that's fantastic. And, you know, we saw you on Channel 4. <laughs> <laughs> earlier I think it was yesterday and they actually brought up a really good point and something that that a lot of people may not know within rodeo you know you're the first african-american pickup man in the history of professional rodeo that's correct and it's it's definitely something i'm proud of it's not really what i what i was thinking about when i did start picking up i really started picking up because i just really liked it and i love it now but yeah it's pretty cool that i'm the only african-american in the prca and, and uh, i'll definitely have that honor for a while i guess because i haven't seen anybody else up and coming although i wish they would but i'll roll with that for now so man and you know they, they've got a really good african-american rodeo down south every year do you ever go and pick up that one you know what i never have uh, when i was a kid i used to go to those uh, all black rodeos a lot and just watch and stuff and kind of learn but since i started picking up I, I really haven't attended any but i really need to do so perfect hey and you know uh, great times let's let's talk a little bit i i know people are going to watch and we got locals but that interview was something <laughs> I, I didn't know what to think. I could only imagine what's going through Jeff Richter's mind. Well, you know, it's not very often, you know, a, a news reporter gets on with huge snow boots on and, you know, a little funky cowboy hat. But, you know, what? he was a, he was a great guy. And uh, we're actually from the same place. He's from Kansas City oh, also. So we got to visit probably about 30 minutes before the actual interview took place. So it was pretty neat. And it's always good to, to get newscasters on horses because, you know, they don't ride but once every few years. So it was pretty neat. Perfect. And then if anybody, if any fans are around, they want to follow you to find out where you're at to see you work, how can they keep uh, on social media? Sure. I'm on uh, Twitter. Uh, JCR Cowboy is my handle. And I'm also on Facebook. Uh, Jeff Rector. Uh, Jeff, R-E-C-T-R is how you spell my name. I definitely post where I'm at and where I'm headed, and uh, so you can always keep up with me there. So. Perfect. Ladies and gentlemen, Jason Hetland here, Rodeo Roundup Backstage, World's Toughest Rodeo 2014, with PRCA pickup man Jeff Richter.